Welcome to RichardBankerWebDesign.com tutorials. Joomla 3, we are looking at caching today and uh, the problem you're having is that you have content here on your website that you've updated. I've gone in and I have this learn more and I've changed it to learn more and I went up and I hit save and when I go on the front it, it still says learn more about this. I'm like what is going on? I've changed this. And I go up here and I I refresh my browser and I go down and it still says learn more about this even though in the back you can clearly say it only says read learn more why is this happening most likely this is happening because uh, you have caching enabled and what caching does is it creates a copy of your website of certain parts depending on how in-depth your caching is set up and it's saving that for quicker browsing. This way when someone comes back, instead of pulling all the data again from your server uh, in, in its raw form, it's pulling it in either chunks or it's actually downloaded it onto your own computer and it's pulling it from there. So I'm going to quickly show you how to clear your cache. Now, we're in Joomla 3. You may be in 2.5 or 1.5, but the general uh, thing is the same. You may just have to look around a bit. So what we're going to do is we're going to go to System here in the main menu under Site, under your Global, and we're going to click Clear Cache. So a after you have click Saved and you notice this isn't working, you'll often see this in modules and things like that. And you can see that we have a page cached. This is this page right here. And we're actually going to delete this. So now it's no longer cached. So now when we go back and we hit refresh, we can see, ah, now it only says learn more. So that is how to clear the cache. And if you're finding that something is just not, you're saving something and it's not showing up in the front, that's the first thing you have to check is just to go in and clear your cache. See if that fixes. If that doesn't fix it, hey, head over to our forums at richardbankerwebdesign.com. We'd love to help you out.